How do you lead a normal life and be self-sufficient when you're dealing with these? Well, I'm gonna share you some of the tips that helped me out getting around grocery shopping and leading as close to a normal life as I could. A great crossbody handbag will also help you out a lot because this will allow you to easily access your keys, your personal items that you may need. This one happens to even convert into a crossbody around the waist or the waist that I don't have and allow you to easily get around and access the things that you need. I am a rather fashionable tourist. Wearing pants or shorts, if it's the summertime for instance, with pockets. I could easily access my keys, uh, my phone, anything that I put in the pockets. Any type of bag with handles, this will be helpful to you. So if it's something that's lightweight, obviously you can use one of these. I know a lot of places don't even offer plastic anymore. I'm a bag hoarder. Well, how do you carry a cup of coffee when you got one of these? So as long as there's a secure lid on it, you can put it in the bag, hold it, and still take your cup of coffee or java with you. A cooler bag. So you see the inside, it's all completely insulated. This allowed me to do grocery shopping on my own. Now certainly you could have that delivered to you, but you know what? I don't trust anybody grocery shopping for me because I know what I like. So I highly recommend if you can get a backpack that is insulated because this will allow you to completely put any of your groceries, especially things like say, heavy items or cartons of milk, put them in your backpack and bring them to your home or your apartment. And I would just keep going back and forth, unloading my groceries and putting them in my backpack. So those are just some of the tips that may help you lead a more normal life when you're dealing temporarily with these.